The sound, Prince Harry in tears as King Charles makes a shocking new announcement. Royal drama captivates the world. Grand palaces and jewels hint at privilege and perfection. But, a complex family saga unfolds behind the scenes. King Charles has made a shocking announcement. He has disowned his youngest son, Prince Harry. This move has escalated a family feud into something severe. How did it come to this? What could make a father cut ties with his son so publicly? Let's explore the story that has captured everyone's attention. The downfall. From beloved prince to black sheep of the royal family. Prince Harry was once the spear to the throne. His rebellious spirit and relationship with Meghan Markle have changed his role. The royal family sees his actions as out of control. His decision to step back from royal duties, known as Megxit, shocked the monarchy. But was it the only reason for the fallout? Was there deeper family conflict before Meghan? Or did Harry's openness about royal struggles betray King Charles? The role of trust. Why King Charles holds faith in Princess Catherine and Prince William. King Charles values tradition and legacy. His closest allies are Prince William and Princess Catherine. They balance modern values with tradition. William and Catherine have embraced their royal duties. Harry, on the other hand, has spoken out against royal pressures. This divide has driven the brothers apart. King Charles and Queen Camilla's relationship is crucial. Their bond has strengthened over the years. Camilla's support has influenced Charles's decision to disown Harry. Is Camilla's influence behind the king's decision? Or did Charles make this choice alone? Guided by tradition and the monarchy's protection? Betrayal? The alleged acts that led to Prince Harry's disownment. Prince Harry has spoken about his struggles within the royal family. His public airing of family issues may have been the final straw. His interview with Oprah Winfrey and Memoir Spare have exposed the royal family's cracks. Harry sees this as self-preservation, not betrayal. For King Charles, Harry's actions are an unforgivable betrayal. They attack the institution he has dedicated his life to. Anecdotal moment. Imagine your son criticizing your life's work. How would you feel? King Charles faced this, and it's affecting him worldwide. The tearful reaction. Prince Harry's emotional response to the announcement. Prince Harry was deeply affected by the news. Those close to him say he was heartbroken and in tears. Being cut off from his family has left a lasting emotional scar. Despite the rift, Harry still loves his father. Yet, reconciliation seems unlikely, given the public nature of the disownment. Relatable question. Have you ever had a falling out with a family member? The pain of losing someone close is unbearable. Harry's tears might be a sign of regret or just a reaction to being disowned. Queen Camilla and Princess Catherine, the new faces of royal stability. King Charles has leaned on Queen Camilla and Princess Catherine during this time. Camilla, known for her loyalty, has been a source of strength. Catherine, dedicated to her royal duties, has become a symbol of hope for the monarchy. Visual Description Picture the royal family on the balcony of Buckingham Palace. Camilla and Catherine stand beside King Charles, showing stability. But Prince Harry is missing, highlighting the family's deep divide. A path forward. What's next for Prince Harry and King Charles? What's next for Prince Harry and King Charles? Some think time can heal the wounds, while others believe the trust is broken. Prince Harry may choose to live outside the royal family, focusing on his charitable work and raising his children. King Charles aims to preserve the monarchy's legacy. With William and Catherine by his side, and Camilla's support, Charles's reign will likely be traditional and structured. This leaves little room for Harry's independent spirit. The final word, a call for reflection. This story is about more than a royal family crisis. It's about family dynamics, loyalty, love, and loss. It shows that even those with everything can face the same challenges we all do. So, what do you think? Does King Charles's decision seem right? Or has Harry been unfairly cut off? The debate is ongoing, and we want to hear your thoughts. Share your comments and let's discuss the complexities of family, tradition, and personal freedom. Call to action. Tell us what you think. Would you have made the same decision as King Charles? Or do you side with Prince Harry? Share this article, comment your thoughts, and join the global conversation. Your opinion could be key to understanding this complex family drama. Let's keep the discussion going. The public reaction, a divided audience. The public response to the royal drama is divided. Some support King Charles's decision to protect the monarchy's stability. They see Harry's disclosures as damaging the family's reputation. 
leaving Charles with no choice but to act. But there's another side to the story. For many, Harry's actions are seen as brave. He chose his mental health and happiness over royal duties. His words about royal life pressures have connected with many who feel trapped by family and society. Did you know searches for how to set boundaries with family and leaving toxic family dynamics spiked after the Oprah interview? Harry's openness has started a global conversation about family expectations and personal freedom. With public opinion split, how will this affect the monarchy's future? Could Harry's move be a chance for the royal family to change? Or is it the start of the end for them? Media frenzy. Fueling the fire or fanning the flames. The media has had a lot to say about this story. Tabloids, TV, and social media have all had their say, each with their own spin. Some see King Charles as strict, while others see Harry as a rebel fighting for freedom. This media storm raises a big question. What role does the media play in family disputes when it's about public figures? Prince Harry has talked about how the media has hurt his mental health. He often points to his mother's death as a reason for his distrust. Yet, the media keeps covering him, making the divide between Harry and his family worse. Is the media impartial in this family drama? Or does it make things worse? How much of what we see is shaped by both sides' narratives? Lessons we can learn. Navigating our own family dynamics. The royal rift is really about family. We may not live in castles, but we can understand the pain of strained family ties. We all face moments when our family bonds are tested. What can we learn from the royal family struggles? Communication is key. Harry felt unheard, leading him to speak out. King Charles felt blindsided, seeing Harry's actions as disloyal. Actionable tip. If you're dealing with family tension, consider these steps. Open dialogue. Don't let issues build up. Talk about them openly and honestly. Boundaries. Set clear boundaries with family, but make sure to communicate them well. Seek understanding. Try to see things from the other person's point of view. Acknowledge their feelings, even if you don't agree. Have you ever felt like you're speaking a different language to your family? This is a common feeling, like Harry's. But can we find a way back after communication breaks down? The ripple effect? Impact on the royal legacy. This disarmament has big implications for the monarchy's future. With King Charles disowning Harry, the royal family's image is at risk. In today's world, being transparent and authentic is more important than ever. The royal family has been criticized for being out of touch. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's decision to step back showed a shift in how the younger generation views their roles. They believed happiness and mental well-being should come first, not tradition. Prince William and Princess Catherine stick to their royal duties. They meet the monarchy's and public's expectations. But is their commitment too strict for a younger audience? Will this moment change the monarchy? Tradition and duty meet modern values. Or will the monarchy keep going as usual? A final thought. Is reconciliation possible? As this emotional saga ends, we wonder. Can Prince Harry and King Charles make up? Betrayal and discernment are fresh. Yet... Time can heal deep wounds. King Charles knows this well. He found peace with Camilla after scandals and divorce. Can he do the same with Harry? Rhetorical question. Can a family torn apart by betrayal come back together? Or are some wounds too deep to heal? Your turn. Share your thoughts. This royal drama leaves us with more questions. What do you think? Is King Charles right in disowning Prince Harry? Or is it a mistake? We want to hear your thoughts. Share your comments below and join the conversation. And don't forget to share this article with friends and family. Call to action. Now that you've read about the latest royal drama, what are your thoughts? Do you think reconciliation is possible? Or is this the beginning of a permanent family split? Comment below, share this article, and let's keep the discussion alive.